Hello! On this episode of Basic Arduino, we will take a look at using arrays in Arduino sketches. For this tutorial, I put together this circuit. In the Arduino sketch, we will be using an array to first define all the pin modes for the LEDs and then use the same array to scroll the LEDs on and off. Also, to make this tutorial more fun and interesting, I added a potentiometer to control the scrolling speed of the LEDs. If you would like to build the circuit and try this out yourself, just look in the description below and you'll find a link to this project's webpage where you will find the schematic diagram and also a copy of the Arduino sketch. Let's go over to the computer and take a look at the sketch. Before we get started, here is a simple definition of arrays. Arrays are a collection of values that are accessed with an index number. All the data stored in an array must be the same data type. Any value in the array may be called upon by calling the name of the array and the index number of the array. Arrays are zero indexed, with the first value in the array beginning at the index number zero. Arrays need to be declared and optionally assigned values before they can be used. For this tutorial, we will be using an integer array. We will call it LED since it will be used for controlling our LEDs. Next, we define that it will have 10 pieces of data being stored in it. Then, we will set our values. I will be using digital pins 2 through 12 on the Arduino, skipping pin number 7. Now that we have our array set up, let's move on. Our next line of code is setting up an integer to store our analog reading from our potentiometer. This will be used to control the speed of the LEDs scrolling by using delays, so we will name it DEL, short for delay. Moving on to the void setup, we are going to use a for loop to set our digital pins used on the Arduino board for our LEDs to outputs. These two lines of code will replace the 10 lines you would need to use to define each one individually. Let's move on to the void loop. The first thing we will do is take an analog reading from our potentiometer. The potentiometer will give us an analog reading of between 0 and 1023. For this project, I want to use delays of between 10 and 100 milliseconds to control the LED's scroll rate so we will use the map function to achieve this. Now it's time to scroll the LEDs. To do this, we will use four loops. One to turn the LEDs on, and one to turn them off. First for loop scrolls them on. We have 10 LEDs with the first one's pin number stored at index zero of our array, and the last one at index nine. So we will set our for loop to count up from zero to nine. Each time the loop cycles, it will turn on an LED using the digital write high command, followed by the delay we have set up to control the scrolling speed until all our LEDs are turned on. Next, we will have a short delay before we scroll the LEDs off. I found that the already defined value times four works good here. To scroll the LEDs off, we again are using a for loop. We are just simply setting it to count down instead of up to turn the LEDs off using a digital write low command followed up by our scrolling speed delay until the for loop counts down to zero. Finally, we have another delay until it goes to the start of the void loop and does everything over and over and over and over again until we turn the power to the Arduino board off. And that concludes this episode of Basic Arduino. Thank you for watching and please remember to like, share, and subscribe.